Hey everyone, welcome to video 5 of our Cheat Engine tutorial videos. This one here is the basics of pointers. So, pointer would be how you'd access an address after the game restarts and reallocates all the memory. Uh, yeah, we'll just show, I guess I could show you a quick example here. So we have 600, is our current value. I'm doing the same scanning as we normally do. Next one's 10, so that's there. But if we restart the game, or if the game reallocates that variable, uh, you can do it just by changing the pointer here. That is still 10, but it doesn't hold this value anymore. So now this address is useless to us. So this is kind of a brief intro on finding pointers. There's another video f further on. I forget which one. I think video number 7 will show you more in depth. So, we are scanning just like normal. And yeah, that's the one. And what we want to do here is find out what ax oops, sorry. find out what access is this address. Change the value a little bit. These four instructions access it. So, generally you want to pick one that doesn't have the same register in both, so you don't want EAX and EAX there because this logs the instructions after they're completed. So it's moving the value inside EAX to EAX. And as you can see now, it's just 2E6, which isn't a location that we want to look for. This one here, the second one, has EDX and EAX. So you can click it and you'll see 0174B150 or you can also grab it down here which is it right there, right there so that one moves EAX into the value pointed at by EDX so we copy that there's no offset so we don't need to worry about that right now again you'll see that in the future video And yeah, that'll actually be the same as here because there's no offset. So we want to do a hex search for a 4 byte and then paste in that exact address and scan for it. Now you see this this address here is green. It means it's static. It's always stored at the exact same location in memory. And it points at what points at sorry, it points at the value the value is the our address there of our variable, so if we want to add this, we can hit add address manually, copy the static address, add it manually, it's a pointer, just paste that one in there, the static one right into there, you can see it points at that now, Let's see, same address is there, same value, change it, changes on both, And you can change your pointer now, and it's still pointing at the proper value. It's now 607. We can change this. Still works. Now, to complete this, all we have to do is change that to 5000, freeze it, change the pointer, and that's it. 